The spin recovery is undeniably one of the hardest goalkeeper moves to learn and pros like Lloris or De Gea do them flawlessly. So in this video, I will show you how to do the spin recovery like Hugo Lloris. Not every goalkeeper knows how to execute this motion, so they stick to the standard way of recovering rather than doing the advanced technique. When doing the spin, you want to kick your top leg forward which will produce the momentum you need to turn your entire body around. As you kick your leg forward, you want to lean back, laying your back on the floor. As you push off, you spin your body more to the other side to finish off the motion. As you reach the final parts of the spin, you plant your top leg onto the ground to produce the power when getting up. With your bottom arm, you also want to push off of it to get you up on your feet. With your bottom leg, try to get it in front of you to make a fluid motion, or you can just put a shin down onto the floor and push off to get extra power when getting up onto your feet. However, using your shin isn't ideal. Now that you know how to spin like Glorice, here are two drills you can do to improve your spin recovery. First drill, a partner would get you to dive to one side and after you have saved that, you would execute the spin recovery to make another save on the other side. This drill imitates you making a double save in a match. Second drill, you would have a partner around your 6 yard line throwing the ball to either side of you for you to save it. As you save it, you would recover to receive a volley before diving again to either side. This drill focuses on your endurance when recovering for the next save, as it is continuous. That's how to recover like Reese. so if you enjoyed or found this video useful, please don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and other than that, that's me, see ya!